All right. Hello, folks. Let me make sure my filters are on before I start. But yeah, we have a group D match. As people in chat were saying, this is a very important match between Ashton and Chris. This is going to be Chris's sixth match out of his seven. I think Fanium next. So this is definitely going to be a, a good point to grab for him to just cement his, cement his spot. I get some game audio as well. Do we get we got delay? A minute. Some game audio. But yeah, we head off to Colorado, which is gonna be Ashton's pick. You'd never guess what Chris's pick is. Two really good maps. Uh, <laughs> yeah, and worth noting that PB needs some needs some fixing, Chris. I think we can knock a one off of that on the right day, especially with the record being in the fives as well. Um, but yeah, I think hopefully everything's okay with the game. I noticed that one minute got added, but. Should be good, and then she's reading up on the lore of Sean Rose. There's actually a ton of lore in these targets. It's crazy. If the game audio is too loud when we get into the match, oh, feel free to let me know. I can turn it down. But yeah, it's been number one. Let's see what we got. So we have Sean Rose Cleaver as the point man, Penelope Graves style sniper rifle as the cook, SMG Sue Ezra. Next snap, technician. This is really fast, huh? This is really fast. This is an orchard star, isn't it? For the sake of getting point man and... I can't tell. I think I think orchard star would be good here. Westbridge is going to be... Oh, snap. No, it doesn't matter. I'm curious. I'm sure the goats in chat will let me know. A lot of planning by players, which is important. Westbridge? Okay. Hmm. Chris is going to be the first person in. Hopefully he gets this. This first minute. Let's have to get the camera SMG. Damn, that was... There's a massive wish for Ashton as well. Shoots perfectly to the gate as well. Crazy. Good timing for Chris here for the basement. Oh, and Chris, it does decide to triple. Got by mistake. And has to restart. However, Ashton has a pistol and a sniper. I'm very surprised by Chris's choice to bring a Trank instead of the sniper. I just want to get that Ezra kill done straight away. I need a bit of buffering for them as well, so they're probably behind by a couple of seconds. But I'll refresh them in a moment of easiness. We still good. I thought my OBS just gave up for a moment. Ashton has Ezra down. Chris finally brought the sniper. Oh, and gets a lockdown. Ah. Unfortunate for Chris, but yeah. You know what, Ashton? Is done with the house and Penelope knocked out as well. Gonna head over now to Point Man. Hopefully that fixes itself. That audio desync. Let me know if it does fix itself now. I'm gonna try to refresh a few things. Ashton grabs that cleaver for the Point Man kill. 
I'm gonna head over now, get ready for my upper valley. Gotta grab a technician. A lag on Chris's side, but I hope it fixes itself. Ashton does get. Oh, misses the chain lore. He's like deaf right now. What's going on with Ashton? Okay, hopefully. Oh, luckily, Ashton gets uh, my on the hook there. I thought that was going to be a big... A big mistake. You know what, Chris is heading over now. To the shed. We're going to grab a technician as well. Next up, technician there for Ashton. Different kills for both players right now. Well, Ashton getting ready now for... I feel like I'm behind. Uh, the chat. Oh, Ashton. How do you get away with that? Is that just like a, a known thing? Since Sean is locked into his animation? That did look risky. Chris doesn't get the, the chain lore. It's very bad. Oh, same thing happening. What are the chances both players face the same issue at the same time? I hope Ashton realizes that's the spec ops now. Okay. They do. Chris finally gets my on the hook as well. There's really not much left now for Ashton. It's kind of just... The fetch quest. Cook is probably the most annoying bit left. I'm gonna give Chris a quick restart. My is down. Here's the kill for Ashton. Two kills left. One being for Ezra, Sue SMG. And now there'll be Militia Cook, which Ashton's grabbing right now. <laughs> yeah, I think it was just an unfortunate double um, huh. mistake. The way um, Maya was waiting for the investigation to be completed. Come on. Got a possible five, one, seven. Chris was not happy about that calling. Oh, this is scary for... Ashton gets the trank off. Grabs of the skies. They're pretty close now to being able to finish this out. Most of their stuff now is going to be in the basement. Meanwhile, Chris, although only has one kill, has the stuff ready here for Sean. And his IGT is about a minute behind, so he's actually catching up IGT wise. This is closer than we thought. Depends on the exit. Is it loud SMG for Chris? Crack kill there for Ashton. I can, I can always feel that hesitation. Ashton getting the... Oh, getting the mask. This could be scary now. Barry, too many players ripped to this mask. Hang in there. Did you see the moon last night? 
50k for Ashton. We'll risk it. Meanwhile, Chris is on the run. Literally just has to get a quick kill. Not too sure if they have to do loud, do they? They don't. It's a sniper rifle. Oh my god. And yeah, that's looking like a GG's. Massive comeback there by um, Chris. There's the finish. There's that delay catching up. And reminding us. <laughs> that it exists, but yeah. That's unfortunate, and I think that photo finish is just a bit too long to actually be of worth for Ashton. If they've managed to get in the 30 seconds. Nah, just outside of it. Actor, that's very good. There we go. We're heading to Berlin. Give Chris a refresh again. Click on surveillance, yeah. That is nice. Yeah, look at that. Same PB for Ashton. 15 minutes, exactly. Is that like a default number or something? Assuming half the spin length? That's a crazy coincidence. <laughs> Rick's asking how he got away with that insane fumble in the RWC chat. Yeah, we all love some Berlin. And we know Chris is a fanatic for it, so... Definitely, um, not a revolution, but players have been getting crazy at this map lately. The record's been dropping every event. I'd love to see some fire. I mean, that's my, my hope. Or a wild floor, but we can't get all of them. It's just running this like almost muscle memory beginning that a lot of players would have. So it's kind of a forced start. Compared to the other ones, because all the disguises are gravel, of course, side suit, so everybody just has to have this ready. Wow. Flexing his 20 to 2 aspect ratio. That head was probably about the size of his mouse. I'm seeing a lot of DJ starts as well, actually. That would be nice to see. Yeah, I think it's the tech mainly. You have to remember, not the actual singular event of the flick onto the camera. I think there's OG, Ralf Grab. Wow, the biker went for that. I actually don't even know what our RNG map is, funny enough. I'll keep it a secret. Yeah, I have zero clue. I hate this baseball throw <laughs> to this biker. Almost caught him. But yeah, let's see what our spin is here for the second map. So we have no target KO, pistol bartender. 
Remote Explosive Delivery Guy, Old Axe DJ, Wall Biker, Silent Sniper Rifle, Pub Crew. That could be a Rolf. No, it can't be Old Axe, I'm an idiot. No, you don't need to spoil. Thank you, though. Yeah, Delivery Guy and Old Axe kind of. Makes us a bit forced upstairs for a little bit, but maybe we'll see our players head down pretty quickly after they get those things sorted. Looks like Ashton might be sticking with the DJ boot. Chris going with the club crew. They will be able to get that kill on green very quickly if they go for that one. The 30 second one. Or oh, the sniper one, even. That makes a lot more sense. DJ Star for Ashton, like we guessed. A lot of frame rate drops, or not frame rate drops, lag from Chris, but hopefully we get to see the kill. Maybe I can do this. I'm gonna use my um as I swear it's not, it's just a stream. Green. I have to get used to it. Agent Green, are you still there? Ashton gets Ralph down. Doesn't actually need Ralph. Needs the biker. Stay focused. He's not playing. Bit of a risky um shot there. You need to knock at them quickly, otherwise they're just gonna be randomly looking. Hello. Jesus. <laughs> he choked. Lovely kill there. <laughs> hey, Chris. Agent Swan, are you still there? Actually choked on an ice cream. <laughs> that I've been sneaking. The night takes rook. That's another one down. Do not let him turn this into a delivery guy down. I have to spend a lot of time on the bikers here, but we actually are going to see our ball floor. Oh my god! Chris is after infiltrating the biker place now. This kill done pretty quickly. So oh, weird, just seeing Rolf and his undies. Ashton's in a bad spot here right now. When Monk gets in this room, you can't knock him out, right? Or you can't kill him. Put him in the side room, I think, but... Lovely car shot there, the Chris. It's Thames all the way over to the car. Hello? Is anybody there? It's just gonna get a knockout. Hopefully, no air alarm. Oof, such a scary um mechanic. Ashton dealing with one of the guards. Hopefully he's okay. Oh, gets caught dragging a body. This is messy now. Yeah, Chris has one kill left now. Old Axe DJ. While I was up on Ashton there. Very tough for Ashton here. He's gonna have a constant hunt that then people are gonna start walking in. Once that biker sees a body is over. It would be amazing to see Ashton save this, but I think it might already be irreversible. Oh, here we go. Chris 
Chris grabs the axe. Now it's just a bit of a a run for him. Oh, and the guy's about to come in. There's absolutely no way Ashton's going to say green. And there it is. <laughs> yeah. It would have been amazing to see Ashton somehow pull green guns out of that, but I'm not sure where he's going to pull them from. Oh my god, Chris. <laughs> Chris. Why? He was pretty much looking to the back of his head there. He was looking left while uh, Chris ran on the right. Ridiculous. I can't believe that was. A lot of catching up here for Ashton. But yeah, look at this timing as well for Chris. Manta's just heading down. I'll be your DJ. I get sorted. Not even sure if it's faster to leave him walk or to leave him. <laughs> Chris is meant to look at him. It was bound to happen once. Nice knockout. It's probably faster to drag actually. Chris heading up now to the roof to get green. But yeah, we're like 30 seconds away here from this Berlin coming to an end unless we get an unfortunate side KO here. I'm very safe. There's the X. It's the kill. And they will be allowed in this area. Double audio. But yeah, there's a finish by Chris. 7.21. A really good time. Mumbai. Super interesting map. Definitely growing on a lot of people, I think. I think it's still a big disliked map. But it's definitely um definitely going on a few people. Yeah, as I was saying at the beginning of this, ideally Chris would like to get six points out of this because he's gonna be finishing up his matches soon. It'd be very tough for Ashton to get out of the kind of hole that he's in with his group right now. It's tough to know because there hasn't been enough matches played to decide it, but. Yeah, I think it's just an XP glitch, right? This happens sometimes. Okay, I think we're back. Yeah, we're back. Apologies about that. I don't know what it was. We just decided to die for a moment. Thanks for the delay rebirth that was for me. Hopefully it doesn't bother the players. See what happened. I think we're good. Right. Yeah, stabilizing now. All right, so let's see what we have for our first Mumbai of this match. <laughs> we have Azir Kale, Sniper Rifle, Elite Tug, Banya Shah Pistol, Bollywood Crew, 
and scissors cashmerian. What a nasty spin. Some tough disguises. The deal whip. Could do. God, I really don't know what you do here. Let's give uh, Ashton a quick refresh. Chris a refresh as well, just to catch up. Alls would want to be your beginning, but Elite Tug is tough, I imagine. I'm not sure if there is a quick one you can grab. A bit of planning here. Not surprised. Two weapons, Cashmerian, Elite. Yeah, it's just crazy. Chris is in though. I think we have a shawl start for them. I think we have a dancer photo shoot. There's panic there. This is one of the Mumbai trolls. My records show a few residential complaints about a new tenant in the building. Something related to Probably not go. Might be worth looking into. Ashen, well, he's gonna replan, just as I mentioned it. This looks quite lost. Oh my God. Forty-seven. Our intel suggests okay. that the maelstrom is they found somewhere way. in the city slums. I've marked the headquarters of the crow on your map. That was a risky whoosh there, by Chris. I want to make sure he understands who he's working for now. Signal me at once when the shop is ready. That is all. Oh my God! Did Chris get the version of the maelstrom where he goes down? That's so unfortunate. Could kind of work out in his favor, though, no? So lucky that water doesn't kill. Yeah, Chris does adapt to it very well. So sorry about this buffering. It generally is, I think, on Chris's side, because Ashton has been going fine. Let's see, maybe turning down. Thanks, then will help. No. Nice KO, though, by Chris. Actions after getting the Bollywood crew is heading over now. Really not a replan by Ashton. Hopefully he didn't forget any of the vital things. The infamous Maelstrom is dead. Very well done, 47. No rest for the wicked, however. On to the next one. Yeah, it was a great start by um, Chris, I think, because of that. Uh, differing Maelstrom that happens sometimes. God, this game is... Insanely irritating. Looks like we have Ashton back as well. The Ashton going up, maybe to get the uh, elite tug. I'd actually love to see that April Cup. I just don't believe you. I it's hard not to believe you when you have the record of a map. Knock out there by Ashton. I can actually do the flag. Just a regular tug for. 
Question. Thanksoided. I'm gonna try to see if I can get this. Seem to hopefully be a bit better. Ashen's getting ready to get an elite hug here, I believe. Chris is already bricked though, and he's just waiting for Vanya. Hang <laughs> Panpo. Classic. Deals with Rima first. Oh, and Ashton's in a weird spot here. I like the gun. Needs to be really careful with coming into this room. Yeah, looks good. Chris does have the Vanya kill done and is heading up the Dowood. Looks okay for timing. Yeah, it looks like they're good. Quick trank grab here from the homeless tent. Doubt they're gonna go for separation here. Unless they're dumping Dowood in the water. Give one more refresh. Ashton did get the mails from Kill as well. Does do the distraction shot, surprisingly enough. Chris does. So we're going to see a quick dump here. Oh, I don't know if I like... Can you dump here? It's a kill. Scary dump there for Chris. For a moment, I doubted that it even existed. Ashton's probably heading over to the Kashmirian now. We're just grabbing his scissors even. Oh, that crowbar is scary. There's the scissors. Chris hopping into that one's tower garden now. Let's get up. This ground floor here. Got by the wood crew. Likely send this one up with the ceiling shot. Even tranks them. Okay, where's the love heart boxers? Write that down. Britnix Jotes Taskmaster. Yeah, not much left here for Chris. I'd love to see a train exit, maybe. Ashton still has to do brick lore, so just a bit too much left. And yeah, Ashton does get Kashmirian. I really hope to see a train exit here from Chris. Don't even know if we have coins or taxi or tuk tuk. Are we going to long range it? Love it. That's one coin. I love the verbal or the non-verbal um, communication. Jesus, very decent. Yeah, that's pretty much a GG for Chris, I think. And Reaper agrees. Yeah, huge point grab for uh, Chris. Unfortunate for Ashton.
You can see you know, asking how many dropped frames. Surely that must have been Twitch's end or Chris's end. 15,000. Oh my god. Bro, it was literally the Louvre with um, <laughs> how many frames he's got. Like a hundred during that entire. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> but yeah, really good game. And also both players. Which they couldn't handle the stream snipe. Nice move. We'll look at the standings pretty quickly. Yeah, there we go. We have Banyan at the top. He has six matches played though. And Derek Lindy need that. Luke at four. He's at 19 in a very good spot because Chris is on five and he's three below that. So Chris would have had what six times five, 30. It was just over 50% of his um possible points for the games he's played so far. Is that I feel like that's not correct. I feel like there's one more match in that. Let's interact. Oh my god, Chris's stream is linked up to this or something. There we go. Yeah, six matches played for Chris. Same as Fanium, but eight points below. Luke would only need three points to surpass Chris in the next two games. Linux has a couple in hand as well to gain 10 points after win the majority of the matches for the maps left. And yeah, it's tough to say for the lower players. We have some random person on two, Zeran on three, and then Mikula is Nash ten, so don't want to say anything yet, but they're definitely going to be fighting for third and fourth place. I think Luke has a really good chance of pulling ahead into second. Banium is just looking a bit too good at the moment, but one match left. But yeah, I think that's where we're going to leave it. We're going to head to the ending screen, see if anybody's ready to raid. Uh, thank you, Reaper, for adminning. Catch you soon.